today is the Ohio State Michigan rivalry game. Rivalry game. Rivalry game. I can't say the word. <laughs> anyway, today is the day. We are so excited. What are we doing? Decorated for what? Michigan and Ohio State. <laughs> yeah, it's high state game day. We're having our skull session, listening to the high state marching band. Will turned it on for us this morning. I am headed to go pick up Hayden from his sleepover, and Will and the girls are gonna get this room looking a little bit more festive for the game. Welcome to HTK Vlogs. Welcome to the channel. Uh, it's been a little bit. It's been a little while since we posted, but things are coming, I promise. Anyway, today is the day. It is the Ohio State-Michigan rivalry game. I can't say that word for the life of me, but that's what today is. I am headed to pick up Hayden from a sleepover, and today he is coming home to watch the game at home because that is what him and Will do every single year together. And this is such a special day for us. I have to call my dad here in a little bit because last year I said that this is my family's big holiday of the year. This is our special event. So if I don't call my dad today, he's gonna be pretty darn ticked off. So I am going to give him a call very shortly. We're gonna bring you along for the whole experience and I'm gonna tell you a couple of stories about why this means so much to me and um, let's have some fun. And then after the game time, you are gonna come along with us to meet the newest member of our family. We are headed into Kroger. I need to get coffee creamer mainly because I have any coffee yet today and I'm exhausted. But we also are going to be getting um, some cheese and crackers to cut up for the game, maybe some pretzels and dip. So let's go in and find some goodies for game time. I'm leaving Kroger. I have all the goodies. Let me show you. Okay, I have all the goodies for the game. It's time to go check out. Now I'm headed to go pick up Hayden and then go home and watch the game and we'll do the snacks here in a little bit. Oh, hi. Hi. Hi, get excited? Yeah. There, Hayden's home. Will is changing our M's because he got them X'd out. He got them X'd out but wasn't thinking. We all realized afterwards. Oh no, we can't use blue tape. It's like, see here? He's gonna change the blue tape to black. Yeah, that's kind of sacrilegious there. <laughs> Yeah, oh, Kaylee even dressed her baby doll in Ohio State, yeah. All right. And the elves are here. Yeah, the elves came last night. The book is for Ohio State, not the elves. So there's Scarlett. This program is unavailable for streaming. Are you serious? All right, so we just had a moment of panic. As you can see, the game, the game's on now. But we have YouTube TV, and it blacks out pregame shows for some reason. For some reason, it that we won't stream pregame shows. And so we knew that, but then Hayden went to turn on the actual game game because it's now 12 o'clock and it was still showing that this is unavailable for streaming. And we had a little bit of moment of panic that we weren't gonna get to watch the game. And we would have loaded up real fast and ran to somebody's house that would let us come in and watch it. But we're all good, game's on, we're ready to go. We're ready to go. Ready to go. Huh? Michigan's unranked. It's gonna be a good game. We're gonna kick their butts. Here's where we found Red at this morning. I'm stuck here with the wrapping paper that they wrap the kids' gifts in. And then, because I don't have any tapes, they had to use packaging tape. And then we got a note saying, get tape, real tape. <laughs> silly elf. You silly elves. I was gonna call my dad, and since I was driving, um, when I stopped at Hayden's friend's house, to pick him up, I just texted him and just texted, go back guys. And he texted me back and I'm so glad I didn't call because I didn't know he had to work today. And my dad's work, they ban radio. He apparently had gone to his boss and gotten permission to um, listen to the Buckeyes on the radio today during work. And it turns out it only plays on AM radio where he's at. So anyway, I guess for some reason he doesn't have AM radio 
reception right now. So he can't listen to the game. He's panicking. So I don't even think he gets off work until 2 or 3. So I'm going to text him again here in a little bit and see if he's gotten it figured out. But I hope so because this game is so important to him. It's so important to my whole family. So I really feel super, super, super bad that he is not able to listen to it. But I have... This is my favorite Ohio State sweatshirt. This was my dad's. He's had it since like the 70s. But see how well it's held up? But I wear it all the time now because it's my favorite. And I have my Ohio State necklace. My Ohio State necklace that Will got me a couple years ago. And we are all set to go. Alright. First play of the game. We are all ready to go. So Michigan takes the field, and when the Wolverines out the football partner, what's the score? Well, with the questions at the quarterback position, they've got to run the football. This has been a very good running team. Yeah, Michigan, we don't want to show them. Since they tend to struggle, they've got to get up to those linebackers, get them blocked like they couldn't last week against Wisconsin. And for Ohio State, those defensive got their spots. Important. Tracy Sprinkle and Draymond Jones have got to play great. Right. Little solitaire girl. And they run it, giving it to the outback, Khalid Hill. Oh, those are cute. I didn't see you guys hung the little stickers down here. Cute. Cute, cute. What'd you say? Daddy crossed, even on the elf on the shelf, he crossed off the end. Oh my goodness, he did, didn't he? All the M's on the calendar, huh? Oh my god. Well, yeah, not every page. <laughs> even on my candle. There's an M. He crossed it off. Oh my goodness, even Tara's birthday card. So crazy. There's Kingston. Here's our new kitty. Our new big fat cat. He's an old boy, but we love him. Indeed, we love Kingston, don't we? <laughs> Bucket or Brutus singing to ya? He's up to more decorating, I suppose. What's Daddy doing? He's putting up the lamination. Yeah. He's putting up the beat that came up north. You want Ohio State to win? Mm -hmm. They gotta get it together, don't they? Yeah. Yeah, definitely need to get together. We're not playing so hot right now. Not yet, huh? That looks so good. Well, awesome. Yay! You guys want to open up your present <laughs> from Scarlet and Red? I told you it was heavy. I did the very first one! It's a game in my making! Woo! And you can make that many more! You can make that four! Awesome! How fun! You always wanted one of those! I know. I'm so excited. Is that what he was wandering around about? <laughs> it wasn't there. <laughs> I was sitting there. I think your dad stole your phone. <laughs> so because of the delay game, we don't get the touchdown? Is that the deal? Jeez. Oh, that's our fault. What do you think, Pippers? You gonna do a dance for the touchdown? You gonna do a dance? Dance for mommy! Dance, dance, dance! <laughs> okay, guys, it's halftime now. The game is tied at 14 14, which is stressing us all out, but we're hanging in there. We have faith. We know Ohio State is going to be TTUN, so we are not worried, not even a little bit. We're gonna go and make some lunch, make some snacks, have some football goodies for the second half, and we are going to watch Ohio State kick Michigan's butt. Okay, snacks are served. We have this, these are hors d'oeuvres that are left over from Thanksgiving. And then we have the cheese cut up, the Ritz to go with the cheese. And then we have wheat thins and these pretzel crisps. 
back here to go with these two dips. That's the jalapeno, that's the spinach artichoke. So let's go serve it. Serve it to our men. Oh, where'd your daddy go? Snacks. How's that look? Good. That big old plate. You want me to get you a plate? Uh, I'll put it on the table and then you can fill up a plate with a snack. Or, okay. or you can just move the table over here. Yeah. All right, fourth quarter check-in. How are we doing? One and by four. We are, they are. We are. Awesome. This is our leftover lunch mess. What are you doing, Pip? I think you just stole a toothpick. Great. You feeling optimistic? Yeah. Still got your hope? Good. A boy and his dog. Look how cute. Commercial time. Let's go check on the girls. The girls have abandoned Ohio State. No, not really. They don't normally watch very much of the game. They always watch a little bit, and then they, then they move on. What are we doing in here, girlies? Playing white. We are at fourth quarter. Five minutes and forty-five seconds left. We need this, boys. Will says we need this. We need this. First down and then some. He was out. Yes. He was out. He was out. He was out. Oh my no. god! No! Yeah, he was out. Oh, was he? Uh oh. Uh, what was that for? It was one on one coverage all the way around press, and we didn't. The Haskins could have kept that. I mean, he came crashing inside before he even gave him the ball. Right there. He'll get better at it. Sorry, I feel good. Nope, right. No. Oh, no. Oh. No. Darn it. Reminds me of last year. That was a long time. Oh, yeah, I know it was. Nice. Yep. There's only two minutes left, too. Oh, gosh. We need that. So they've won, well, I don't know what year they lost, but pretty much every single game since you've been alive, Hayden, well, against them. Well, I guess seven years ago they lost. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, that makes sense. So, like, half an hour. Yes. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. That's great. There's your final score. Yep. Ah! Good job, my guys. All right, we got to cover around, Paul. Hey, go bye, guys. Excited? Yeah. Did you get home in time to see the end? Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah, I got home. A little bit left in the third. Oh, okay, good deal. Yeah. I had him on at work. Yeah, I'm glad that you got that figured out. I'm already going to bed. What? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 10 to 2 in the morning. Oh, what time you got to be at work? Uh, clock in at 3.30 today. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Oh, I'm glad you got to watch part of the game. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they let me have it on the radio or, or I put it on the computer. Yeah. We're getting ready. We're going to go see the new baby and have dinner with Glenn and Kaylin and the boys. So. Okay. I'm 
she's home, huh? Oh, yeah, she went home the next day. Oh, shit. Yeah, so that's where we're headed. Gonna go get some yeah. baby time. Alrighty. Alright, well, I love you. Well, I love you. Be careful. Oh, we will. Next week. Yeah, I know. We're excited for that. All right. Well, I love you. I love you. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, <laughs> okay, guys. Ohio State just won the game. We are so excited. We can't hardly contain ourselves. This was got a little bit nerve-wracking there for a little bit. Halftime was a little bit worrisome, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I just want to say before we go for the day that this team, this rivalry, which I cannot say that word still, but... This, this team means so much to us. It's something that for generations has been a big part of our family. My grandpa was a high school football coach and one of his players went on to play for Ohio State. Now, he played, this player played during Woody Hayes' amazing reign over Ohio State and you all know how epic and how iconic Woody Hayes is. Well, um, during an Ohio State-Michigan game, during a game just like today's, Ohio State lost. And after the loss, Woody Hayes threw down his hat on the ground. The player scooped it up, went to hand it back to his coach. And Woody told him, I don't want it. It's not lucky for me anymore. That player, knowing how much that my grandpa, you know, loved the team and loved Woody Hayes, he brought it home to my grandpa over Christmas break. And that hat that was stained with Woody Hayes sweat all the way around the rim of the hat, it hung in my grandparents' kitchen my entire life. It always hung on the Ohio State wall in the kitchen. And um, when my grandpa passed away, we actually buried him with that hat. And it's just something that is so incredibly um, special to us. The team itself, the um, just the community of being an Ohio State fan is just something that is uh, can't really be explained. But you just know it. You know it when your blood is not just red. It is scarlet and gray. Um, you know you're a high State fan, and it is so precious to me and so special to me that I married somebody who is an Ohio State fan. We're raising our children to be Ohio State fans. Um, they still have my dad and my uncle around to share the love of the Buckeyes. Ohio State was just such a huge part of my life growing up. Um, I remember coming home from school one day, and it was the day that Woody Hayes had passed away, and we had a big like 18 by 20 portrait of Woody hanging on our living room wall, and I just sat in front of that picture and cried and cried and cried and cried because I genuinely thought that we were related to him. Like I, I didn't know that he was just the Ohio State football coach. I thought that he was a relative. Like That's just how, how important the team is and how important... Um, the players and the coaches were to my family and are still today. So I'm just really proud to be part of this fandom and I'm glad these guys get to experience it too and really know how kind of crazy their mom is. <laughs> That's all. It's just, we're huge Ohio State fans. It's just something that is a part of us. If you're not an Ohio State fan in this family, then you are not family because we are all about the Buckeyes. What should we say, guys? The Buckeyes won. What do we do? Go Bucks! Go Bucks! Go Bucks. Oh, I am. I got to bye bye. So, Uncle Hayden has baby Kaysen, no. the newest Buckeye. There's the newest Buckeye in our family. You say as he's wearing a yellow hat and perk blue on his blanket. I know. <laughs> he looks like he's a Wolverine fan, but we promise he's not. No, you're a Buckeye born and bred, aren't you, sweet boy? <laughs> Oh, he says, no pictures, no pictures, please. So you're the newest Buckeye fan ever, huh? <laughs> yes, you are. You're the newest Buckeye fan. He's our sweet little Buckeye, four days old. Okay, guys, that's it for today. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Because we have not been posting frequently, make sure that you hit that bell notification so you know when we do. Because regular videos are coming, we promise. So we hope you enjoyed this video. We hope that you are excited about State 1 like we are. And we hope you have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Talk to you later. Bye. Talk to you later. Yeah. See you later. Bye. Hey guys, before I go, please make sure that you watch 100,000 Cameras, Ohio State at Michigan, 11.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on Fox. They are putting on a little documentary showcasing the greatest rivalry, rivalry, still can't say the word, in college football, and it's going to be on that morning, and you may get to see some footage from this vlog. So make sure that you check that out, set your DVRs. It will also replay on Fox Sports 1 on Saturday or Sunday and Monday night. So th that will be airing 
on December 3rd, 11.30 a.m. on Fox.